Hi everyone, Giuliano here. In this video, I'll show you Microsoft Teams templates. But before to jump in, hit the subscribe button and ring the bell so you don't miss my next videos. Microsoft in these days is rolling out a new feature called Templates for Microsoft Teams. This feature allows you to fulfill business requirements in your organization by creating new team based on existing templates. You can create a new template in several ways. A template contains predefined channels, apps and tabs. I'll show you every step to create a new template and to use it when you create a new team. Ok, let's jump on my PC and I'll show you every step. Let's go! Here I am on my PC and I have Microsoft Teams open. Let's start to explore this new feature, Microsoft Teams templates. First off, let me start to create a new team. Clicking on Create Team, the Create panel will show up and as you can see we have a new user interface here. We have the classic way to starting from scratch or creating a team from an existing group. And then we have this new section dedicated to templates. So we can start to create a new team by reusing an existing templates. Microsoft provides several existing templates like Adopt Office 365, Manage a Project, we have a short description here, Manage an Event, Onboard Employees, Organize a Desk, Collaborate on Patients, then collaborate within a bank branch, collaborate on, glob, on a global crisis event, coordinate incident response, hospital quality and safety, organize a store, and finally we have retail manager collaboration. So now I want to launch my product Drone X. In order to, to do that, I will reuse this template manage a team and here we have a full description of this template and then we have a summary what there is inside of this template we have predefined seven channels general announcements budget content logistics planning marketing and pr and we have five apps onenote planner website wiki and youtube looks good to me let's start to create it then i have to select the privacy of this team will be private and let's start to write something here i will add this emoji i created a video how you can add emojis in the title of a team in microsoft teams you can click on the top right corner right now or there is a link in the description of this video okay let's type in loans drone x okay and let's start to create this new team based on the template create an event this will take some time so you can even close the panel if you want to work on other stuff in Microsoft Teams and this is what I'm gonna do. We have now this new team created but as you can see there are no additional channels inside we have just the general so the the process in background is working to reproduce the template. All right the creation is completed now and we can start to explore this new team just created. I got a notification here, your new team is ready. Okay, so in the general channel we have the classic posts, files, wiki, and then we have team information, and this comes from the template. Even plan, we have planner, and again meeting notes. I have six additional channels here, announcements, budget, content, logistics, marketing and PR and planning in announcement I have the classic uh, three tabs in content the same thing logistics again so I have just the additional tabs 
in the general in budget i don't have other tabs but in the general channel i have these three three tabs now these templates are great because i can extend the creation of new teams but i need additional templates to fulfill my business requirements i want to create now a new template and reuse this template for future new teams okay let's open now the teams admin center because there is exactly where you can create new templates an admin is required to do that here i am now in the microsoft teams admin center clicking on the teams menu item expanding the sub menus we can see a new menu item available here called team templates let's click on it and here we can see the templates that just we explored before by creating a new team in the panel available so we have the adopt office 365 manage a project manage an event and this is exactly the template that i reused for my new team i started to play with it and i already created a template here called training it's time to create a new template now clicking on the button hard this will open a new page with three different options so i can create a new template from scratch or i can reuse an existing theme as a template and finally i can even create a new template based on existing templates let's go ahead with the first one and i will create now this new template typing in the title workshop a short description is very important because will appear during the creation of a new team in the team creation panel manage your workshop in the full description we can just type collaborate with your colleagues to create a great workshop okay the locale it's okay english clicking on next and now we have we have this page where we can define channels apps and tabs so we have the classic general tab so then i want to create a new one calling this channel brain storming i want to show by default this channel and then here we can start to add tabs so i want to have in let's say for example sharepoint pages and then i want to have one note okay clicking now on apply we will see in this column tabs these new tabs just added i want to add also the price up in this team template and clicking on apply we will have now this price up available so it looks good to me i defined channels the tabs for this new channel and then the the apps in this team template clicking on submit this will create now this new template here we go workshop let's start to create now a second template i'll walk you through across this second option use an existing team as a template i want to reuse now this template where i am owner global hr i have even the emoji here if you are not familiar with it i created a video how you can easily add emojis in microsoft teams especially in the title okay let's type as a title manage department short description here again manage department 
and here I will add just some uh, emoji this one it's okay English language it's okay next and finally I have these channels that are available in uh, in the team that I already have in my organization I can click on the onboarding for example and here I can add additional tabs uh, let's get one note for this one and for the general editing the general I want to have the planner as a tab now I will rename this channel by removing HR apply then here again HR and the last one okay that looks good I want to add additional apps here we have this already available lists price planner forms let's see let's add also ideas employee ideas apply and it looks good to me we can submit this new template so we have now just created this new template by following the second option by creating a new template with an existing team okay let's go now with the third option start with an existing template and this is the the easiest one because you have just to select the existing templates that you have in this list and let's go with the onboard employees so clicking on next here you have the title renamed with copy added to the existing title then you have the description reused short and full description and then the language onboarding employees I will add an emoji here let me search for users let's go with that one it's not so nice but it's okay clicking on next now I get access to the to the template structure where I have channels apps and tabs so in the employee shop chat I have Yammer as tab and in the training I want to hunt here SharePoint pages here we go apply and then in the announcement I want to add lists as a tab okay now other apps that i have here are wiki communities and i want to add also price here we go okay i am ready to submit this third template and here we go now i created these three templates in three different ways so you can follow the the one which is better for you to fulfill your business requirements okay going back now on Microsoft Teams we can check if these new templates are available let's create a new team clicking on the create a team and here I have now the onboard employees manage department and workshop let's click on one and we can see the channels that I created general brainstorming OneNote price and SharePoint pages great all right we have seen in this video tutorial how to make more flexible the creation of new team in Microsoft Teams based on existing templates
If you enjoyed the video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to stay tuned with my next videos. If you want to see me cover any other topics in the future, put a comment down below, I read them all and this is also how I build my to-do list for my next videos. I hope to see you next time. Bye!